Aloha. I'm Dr. Glenn Swartout, author of a couple of books that I'd like to give to you today. One is Materia Medica. It's an over 500-page encyclopedia of natural medicine, covers herbs and nutrition, the the physical medicine. Materia Medica is the traditional term for a a, a book of medicines, of physical medicines. And uh, the second volume, we have two, two books because they didn't fit into one, over 300 pages that I decided to call Anima Medica, and we created a second book of what didn't fit in the first one. We put all the energy medicines in here, homeopathy, color and light, frequency medicine. There's, and both of these in, incorporate my philosophy that I call the clinical theory of everything. You'll be learning m- more about that, not only in the books, but in uh, courses that we'll be offering you as well. Uh, and we're developing medicines that, that fit in with that philosophy. It's, it's a way of looking at, at, at life, at consciousness, at development, at healing, at disease, a really a comprehensive view of how the world works. How does, how does the body grow from one cell to many? What, what are the, how is it organized and structured into tissue layers? And, and when we heal, what's the importance of that? How does a toxin get out from a deep inner layer through the other layers? And how does it produce symptoms along the way that aren't the problem, but a sign of the healing? So we need to be able to read the roadmaps along the way, a uh, system I call the five phases of healing, where the biophysics, that's really the energy of the body tissues defined in, in physics, uh, of the Nernst equation, which determined, is determined by three different factors, basically the protons, the electrons, and the photons of light. And again, we'll go into more of that. You'll have access to training and information on these things, as well as the natural medicines that flow from that view of a natural view of how the body functions, rather than trying to throw drugs, toxins, uh, throw damage of surgery at a dysfunction. Adding more dysfunction to the original dysfunction doesn't make us healthier. Do people get healthier because they have health insurance? We spend thousands of dollars a year on health insurance. I gave it up in my in my 20s when I found out I was going to be dead before I was through my 30s if I didn't change the fundamentals of my health. I had to remove heavy metals, had to do dental restoration work to remove the the source and the cause, and and treat over the years many layers of of stresses in my body. And we've got a whole system that we've developed of how to do that. It's based on electrophysiology, uh, German diagnostic electroacupuncture, where we actually measure the energy flow in the meridians of the body. So it integrates with homeopathy, it integrates with with uh, oriental medicine and other systems of natural medicine that look at the function of the body and work on bringing up the function to heal rather than bringing down the functions that are trying to heal and causing symptoms. <clears throat> so. I know you're going to love this uh, approach and this material. It it works. Uh, It it works so much faster and you're going to feel better faster. Uh, And and it follows the first rule of medicine. First, do no harm. You know there's a problem with your medical system when uh, in in the last uh, couple of of, uh, uh, generations, there have been several times around the world, in Israel, South America, and California, where the medical system went on strike. You know what happens when the doctors go on strike these days because of the nature of our invasive medical system based on drugs and surgery? The death rate actually goes down. People stop dying as fast because they're not being treated with drugs and surgery. So if you're the kind of person who's looking to take care of your own health and you really want to understand how to do that and understand what your body is saying to you, this is the right place. And again, we have these uh, books for you for reference. They'll be in ebook form, so it's really easy to look up symptoms, conditions, remedies, find out a whole new uh, way of looking at how all this works together. That's again based on function and development and healing uh, from a functional point of view of bringing up what's good to heal what's not good, rather than focusing on what's not good and trying to kill it in a living system with things that aren't, that have never existed until the last couple generations. Most drugs are synthetic. They never existed for our DNA. We can't possibly be adapted to them. There's no reasonable, reasonable, logical uh, expectation that this biological system could receive those as a healing stimulus when it's never 
been exposed to them in our genetic history. So welcome home to natural medicine um, and look forward to seeing you inside. <laughs>